Hey guys, back in the garage, and I just wanted to do another quick install video. And today I will be installing the Built-Right Industries uh, dash mount for 2009 to 2014 F-150s and Raptors. It's a pretty easy install, but I just wanted to go through it real quick with you guys. So I've already test fitted in the truck real quick and made sure everything was, the clearances were good. So with that out of the way, I wanted to go ahead and install these ram mounts that I've purchased and to install them I'm just using some socket head screws that I picked up from uh, Home Depot. So it's a pretty easy install. Uh, let's get at it. Check it out guys, in about five minutes I was able to install these RAM mounts using the hardware that I bought from Home Depot. And the cool thing about these mounts is you can put uh, uh, phone mounts, you can put GPS mounts, really whatever. You can even do GoPro like I, I'm planning on using. So I'm really excited and next we'll put it in the truck. So we're in the car now and the first thing you want to do is take this rubber mat off like so. You can put that to the side you don't want to throw it out because if you ever take this out, you can just throw it back in. You're going to need your wrench with a 7 millimeter socket. want to just push it back a little and don't just yank on it because you have a tab right here for your speaker so you'll want to disconnect that pin then you can remove it from the, the truck all right so I removed the tray from the truck and I placed it on to the workbench and I've already screwed out the holes I actually did that off camera well not planned to do it off camera I forgot to press play and I uh, cut the holes so the holes are cut and I can take them out and using the uh, provided hardware from built right you can place it in and then easiest if I do both at the same time. I have it on the tray and everything looks like it's lining up pretty good so I'm going to tighten this down and then we're going to put it back in the truck. that I received with the kit is just a little bit too long. There's a module just underneath the uh, the mounting for the tray and I don't know if it's uh, with all F-150s or all Raptors or whatever but the right hand side the passenger side has the normal mount uh, for the screws and the left hand side or driver's side has a smaller mount because there's a module that sits underneath it and mounts into it so if I don't uh, trim this down a little bit it could uh, go into the module. All right guys, so we're back in the car and we're ready to install this. So first thing you're gonna wanna do is get the uh, plug, 
for your speaker. And plug it back in. Then simply slide it into place. And now we're going to just screw it down. Alright guys, that wraps everything up with this video, and uh, I'll show you what I'm going to put on this on the next video. Thanks guys.